In this video, you will learn the basics about ARCHICAD objects, its library, and what are the available options for object creation in ARCHICAD, what are the similarities and differences compared to other BIM software. In other BIM applications, there is also the possibility to work with parametric objects or families. Usually, it can be assigned to three different uses. The system families, like walls, floors, ceilings, and other building elements, the in-place families, those modeled directly into the project with geometric shapes and voids, and the loadable families, which are usually external files loaded into the project, either parametric or not. This last use is the one we would like to focus on right now. In ARCHICAD, the equivalent to this is the object. There is a dedicated tool for objects where you can find all the library parts needed either from the local libraries loaded into your project file or from the Graphisoft online repository bimcomponents.com. Some complex hierarchical tools might also use objects for their parametric parts, like stairs, railings and curtain walls. Most commonly in other BIM software, you can choose some default libraries to be installed with the software. It brings a handful of parametric objects, but it is very common creating custom-made families or downloading those from different websites. Although it's also possible in ARCHICAD, we will talk about object creation in a minute. The default ARCHICAD library will bring hundreds of objects, all highly parametric and well organized into folders. Besides these aspects, another important difference is that in other BIM applications, the families are loaded into the project file, while in ARCHICAD, although it is possible to embed objects into the project file, it is a common practice to link the libraries, and by doing this, the file size and the performance are not affected as much. In ARCHICAD, there are many different ways to create objects. You can simply model them using tools such as Morph, to freely model any 3D shape or any other tool, since you can classify the elements however you wish. Optionally, you can save these 3D shapes as easily as with one click with the Save Selection as Object function. Still in ARCHICAD, it is also possible to use, edit and create object parts for existing parametric tools like stairs, railings, doors, windows and more. And of course, you can create parametric objects in ARCHICAD by using GDL. This is a programming language used by Graphisoft to develop highly parametric objects. Alternatively, you can enjoy a friendlier interface with Paramo, which has a node-based interface, so you don't need to write a single line of code. It's important to learn these differences, those will help you understand how both solutions work, and you'll be able to learn and optimize your work faster.